All right, so we are currently an hour away from Shark Valley, uh, I think it's Shark Valley Research Center or Shark Valley Visit, yeah, Shark Valley Visitor Center. We're gonna be exploring that today before heading to the Keys and doing some more stuff, which is on a separate video, but um, I have never been to the Everglades. The only national park I have ever been to is, um, I wanna say Mammoth Cave was a national park. I don't know, but regardless, today we are exploring the Everglades. A uh, small portion of it. There's a lot of shit on this list to do, and there's limited time on certain things. But I've never missed the Everglades. I've always wanted to check it out. So I mean, I figured, why the heck not? So I still got a decent way to driving to go. There's what I'm looking at right now, uh, driving time and stuff like that. But um, look how like open this place is. Like all you see is palm trees for miles and miles. Like, I literally just saw a forest of palm and, like, this, like, weird type of... Yeah, yeah, like that, like that, like that. I saw that everywhere. Like, just crowds of it. And I um, got a little Florida drivers, man. They're nuts. Anyways, so, um, I just saw crowds of it. And I'm just like, what? Like, I was in my Airbnb. Um, I actually got wrapped, too. I got wrapped. Somebody, somebody made a rap of me. And they said I'd become famous. Like me become famous? No, I don't think so. But anyways, we are going to the Everglades. The Everglades. So, uh, I guess the only way to really describe it is just to go there. I don't know what the fuck it's like. Um, I've heard it's swampland. I know there's monkeys somewhere. I mean, I hope I don't get bit by an alligator or hit an alligator with my car. Because I see videos like that all the time. Holy crap. We're literally in the middle of nowhere right now. Oh, I can't wait. So right now, there's literally just like openness. And then to the left, I mean to the left and to the right of me, it's just nothing but like open, like bayous and just nothing. Like, I haven't seen any, I think I saw a gas station like five miles ago, but like, it literally had like two people there and then that's it. Everything else is just so open and away from, I wouldn't say away from society because you know, you still got like people here and there. I mean, where on earth is there not people? But this place, it's, it's huge. Like I don't know how else to describe it besides saying it's fucking massive. And I'm not even like into the main area yet. Like this, this national area, like this national, um, this national park, it covers, pull up on a map, that much. It covers literally the equivalent to like, I wanna say like one eighth or one seventh, one sixth, I don't know, something like that, of um, Florida. So it covers that big percentage of Florida. And it literally separates the mainland in a way, even though it's part of the mainland, from the Florida Keys, which is pretty cool. And that's why, I, that's why I'm going there. It's like, it's in the direct route. I've never been, and I figured, fuck it, let's do it. All right, let me um, let me talk to the guy up there, get everything settled, get my ticket or whatever, and then I'll figure out what to do from there. But time to explore the Everglades. Morning. Good morning. Welcome to the Everglades. I appreciate it. It's first time being here. Awesome. Awesome. Where are you coming from? Oh, I'm coming from South Georgia. South Georgia. So you're not that far away. You know? Oh yeah. Yeah, yeah, oh yeah. So, do you have a plan to something to see here? Like, um, you know, or do you know what you see here? Oh, uh, the observation tower, for sure. Yes. Yeah. So, just the way you know to get there, you're not going to use your vehicle. Uh -huh. It's by biking, hiking, or taking a tram tour at 11 o'clock. Alright. Okay. Um, how much is the tram? The tram tour is 27 bucks. It's going to be inside in the visitor center. Mm -hmm. um, the entrance fee is 30 Unless you're a veteran or a military, or you're gonna see on other national parks. There's an 80 also for all national parks. Mm -hmm. Depending where you're gonna do, yeah. Yeah. Um. Okay. Well, entrance, I guess. Just the normal entrance. Yes, sir. And then I'll go oh. to the visitor center to get the tram, right? Yeah. So what you're gonna go is go up ahead. You're gonna see the parking lot. It's very obvious. And then you're gonna see the app, visitor center. Go mm -hmm. behind it if you're gonna buy your tram tour ticket. Gotcha. Awesome. Here's the receipt 
this valid for seven days for the whole Everglades, okay? Yes, sir. Appreciate it. Enjoy. Thank you. That was awesome. You can go straight, find the tram station, go ahead and buy a ticket, and do other stuff. That means I'm pretty much stuck here for the next two hours. Oh my Waiting God. for pairing. No. I enjoy how that's just like swaying the entire time I've been driving. But uh, visitor center is right there. We gotta buy a tram ticket before um, 11 starts. It is 10.30 right now, which means I need to probably haul. But, but, uh, I like how when you buy this, it's $30, but it's, it's good for seven days. So I'm obviously gonna be here for one day, so. That's awesome, but um, I'm going to put that right there just in case they need validation or whatever. But um, let's do this crap. So first I'm going to go to the tram over there, and then I am going to go over here. So um, I think he said go to the visitor center first, so let's do this. <laughs> Considering that I'm from South Georgia, I still will burn like I've never burned before. <laughs> Little tip, if you're in Florida, um, always wear sunscreen. Hell yeah, so I bought me some sunglasses. I figured I'm gonna need them for the keys, but for anybody that's coming to Shark Valley, um, the Everglades, it costs $30 for a seven day ticket. And the, you have to buy a tram to get, you have to buy a tram to get to where I'm going, which is the observation tower. Um, you probably see it from the cover of this video and the you know title i don't know what i'm titled it yet obviously but um you have to be at the station which you'll see in a second in five uh, minutes before and pretty much you can buy all kind of stuff in the gift shop and all kind of stuff it costs 20 no no it costs 30 something dollars to do the tram tour which lasts two hours so you know list right here of course but um relatively cheap considering that it's a national park um i'm probably gonna spend more money here than i do in the keys but um let me eat get ready for the tram tour and let's do this self-guided exploratory time folks you have 20 minutes for all your own exploration captain of the myself will be 
Disturb wildlife is a five thousand dollar fine. What the fuck? Okay. Oh, check this out. It reminds me of the um. Oh. Heard something. So we're taking us up to the very top of this place. I'm also a first up, so you're welcome. <laughs> well, besides this. Hey man, you can keep it, all right? <laughs> There's a pardoning gift. <laughs> this place is massive. And not only that, it's like... something whoa what the heck is going on there is that fish Well, that is the end of Shark Valley, one of the areas inside the Epic Lakes National Park. Um, there'll be more videos to come. Um, this is just the beginning. Feel free to like, comment, subscribe if you like my content, or if you have any questions or recommendations for me, comment below or give me feedback or feel free to subscribe. Appreciate you sticking around this long. And without further ado, I'm leaving the rest of your day. So stay safe, stay awesome. Peace.